Protesters are gathering outside of the house of Ahed Tamimi, and there's really two messages that they want to impart. The first is to the Palestinian leadership. They want a determined non-violent resistance movement. The other, of course, is to the Israelis, that uh, the Tamimi family, Nabi Saleh, this whole area will not be bowed, will not be broken, and that they should release both the mother and Ahed Tamimi uh, as soon as they can. Now, this is ahead of a court appearance taking place at Ofer uh, on Monday. Now, we've been speaking to Palestinians here. This is what they've had to say. The external message to the Israeli right-wing government, Palestinians are united behind Ahd, behind her passion, behind her resistance. We are all here uh, in Nabi Saleh from all over West Bank to recruit more Palestinian people to this uh, program. Ahd is not alone. Tamimi family is not alone. Nabi Saleh is not alone. In the other hand, we ask our friends all over the world to uh, show bitter solidarity and to start really with a concrete action to isolate Israel and increase the cost of occupation on the Israelis. I want to tell the Israelis, we as Palestinian people and Palestinian children, we will continue to defend Palestine. We will get Aqsa Mosque and Jerusalem back and we will make Jerusalem the eternal capital for Palestine. The Israelis started firing tear gas canisters into the crowd to push them back. Now, this was a peaceful protest. The protesters are now very angry and the Israeli army are using as much tear gas as they can to push them back.